Hey guys, what's happening? Thanks for tuning in and checking out the channel. Hey, like I said, my first moto vlog, um, I had horrible audio issues, um, and then I did a second moto vlog, and I actually um, corrected the audio issues. So uh, I explain what I did in the video, but I wanted to do a little more detailed and show you exactly what my modular helmet looks like, uh, how I set up my modular helmet, um, for uh, good audio and um, what worked for me. So even if it, even on the non-modular helmet, this would probably be very similar, but on the modular helmet, um, it's a little more difficult. And I didn't really see much out there on how to set it up um, because you have this opening and closing of the whole front um, and that creates a little bit of an issue. So let me show you exactly what I did so you guys can cut to the chase that, that haven't got it resolved or if you're looking at possibly getting set up. Um, this will just help kind of speed things up for you and uh, you can minus the pain of that horrible audio that happens to a lot of us. So anyway, this is the LS2 and I'm running a GoPro Hero 7 on the front. I'm using this adapter right here that's called a Sherwu, I think. S-U-R-E-W-O. It comes in a pack, it was like 20 bucks, I think. Um, and then I'm using the, right here, standard like GoPro, little bit of a curved sticky stuck on. Now here's where it gets tricky is, then I went through and I put black silicone around the edges and let it dry for 24 hours and the thing's rock solid and it looks good. Uh, so then, spinning the thing around, this is the adapter. You have to have the GoPro adapter, it comes down. This I glued on, this, is, this was glued on with uh, 3M sticky, double sticky tape that I got from Home Depot. I pushed this on and then same thing, I went around the edges uh, with black silicone and that kind of just tidied things up and made it just a little more solid. And then what I did after that is you plug in the purple panda. That was the key guys, was the purple panda. The mic I had on here before was garbage. Um, I think I ended up just throwing it. I don't even remember what it was. It was so irritating. But I replaced it with this purple panda and it's worked great. Now, I ordered black duct tape. I know this looks a little rough, but it's honestly, guys, it's not too horrible, okay? And, and then as I run up, notice that the cable comes out and it comes up into this little bit of the loop here and then it comes straight down and then it goes underneath and then it goes into, I'm gonna lift this up and show you what happens. And watch this, this is key, watch what happens with this. You see how that cable now is perfectly straight and clean? You can open and close this thing and have no issues. You just have that little bit of a, little bit of a loop there, okay? That took me a while to figure out, but um, I'm glad to share it with you guys. So then, as you can see, it comes in here and it goes into my cheek, left cheek pad. So you see the cable comes up, goes underneath, and then right here, you guys, I put the Purple Panda. What a name for a product too, pretty cool. Purple Panda. Um, and then that goes on. So then a little bit of it shows right here. Uh, and again, I, had a, I put the Dead Cat on here, which comes with the Purple Panda kit. Um, and that's it. Glued that guy in there, or actually just sitting in there. Um, the cheek pad actually holds it tight and solid. So that's it, man. And this thing, this thing looks good. I mean, it looks pretty cool coming down the road. Um, and man, solid as a rock, you guys. This is solid and I'm getting good footage out of it. Um, and hopefully in my next videos, um, we'll just be able to see uh, hopefully better footage and, and continue with good audio. So anyway, guys, hope that helped out. Um, hit that like button, hit that subscribe, um, and we'll see you on the next one, all right?